Welcome to a journey through the mesmerizing world of ancient Egyptian religion, a vibrant tapestry of myth, divinity, and belief that shaped one of history's most iconic civilizations. Imagine stepping into a world where the sun itself is a god, the afterlife is as real as life itself, and every aspect of existence is intertwined with the divine. This was the reality for the people of ancient Egypt, whose religion was as vast and intricate as the Nile that flowed through their land. In this ancient realm, the gods were more than distant figures. They were powerful beings who walked among the people, influencing every facet of life and death. At the heart of this pantheon was Ra, the mighty sun god, blazing across the sky each day. Ra's journey wasn't just a daily occurrence. It was a divine drama of creation and renewal, as he battled the forces of chaos each night to rise again at dawn. But Ra wasn't alone in his celestial endeavours. The gods and goddesses of Egypt were a bustling, dynamic family. Osiris, the god of the underworld, presided over the realm of the dead with wisdom and justice. His story was one of death and rebirth, intertwined with his devoted wife Isis, the goddess of magic and motherhood. Together they formed a divine triad that gave hope of eternal life to those who honoured them. Horus, with his regal falcon head, symbolised kingship and protection. The pharaohs, who were considered gods on earth, were believed to be his earthly manifestations embodying his divine authority. His nemesis Set represented chaos and destruction, bringing storms and strife to the world, a constant counterbalance to the order maintained by gods like Thoth, the ibis-headed deity of wisdom and writing. At the heart of this religious universe was the concept of Ma'at, the divine principle of balance, order and truth. Ma'at wasn't just an abstract ideal, it was a living force that the Egyptians believed they must uphold to keep the universe in harmony. Temples were the epicentres of this divine drama. These sacred spaces weren't merely places of worship, they were the homes of the gods on earth. Daily rituals performed by priests from offerings of food and incense to grand ceremonies ensured that the gods remained favourably disposed towards the people. Death and the afterlife were pivotal in Egyptian belief. For the ancient Egyptians, life didn't end with death, it merely transitioned to another realm. This belief was reflected in their elaborate funerary practices. The process of mummification, intricate tomb designs and the inclusion of personal items in graves were all meant to secure a safe passage and a comfortable existence in the afterlife. In the Hall of Mayat, the soul's heart was weighed against the feather of Mayat in a judgment that determined one's fate in the Field of Reeds, a paradise where the deceased would enjoy eternal life if found worthy. Egyptian cosmology was a rich tapestry of creation myths. One such myth spoke of Atum, the primordial god, who emerged from the chaotic waters of Nun to create the world. The daily journey of Ra across the sky and his nightly voyage through the underworld symbolised the endless cycle of life, death and rebirth. In every city, local gods held sway, each with unique characteristics and roles, but the divine hierarchy was fluid. Gods merged, associated and intertwined in an ever-evolving pantheon that reflected the dynamic nature of Egyptian belief. The ancient Egyptians' divine world influenced every aspect of their culture, art, architecture and governance. Their legacy, a profound testament to their spiritual and cultural achievements, continues to captivate and inspire the modern world, and so, as we unravel the threads of ancient Egyptian religion, we glimpse a civilization that revered the gods not just as distant entities, but as integral parts of their daily lives and their eternal destinies. Through their myths, rituals and beliefs, the ancient Egyptians created a worldview where the divine and the earthly were forever intertwined, a narrative that echoes through the corridors of history.